Good day guys, Spin here. Um, so today let's try try this. How to add this reflection to the model lines? Up. Okay. Okay. So um, let's talk about this. So um, usually in street uh, in AutoCAD we use uh, this pattern to uh, indicate a glass, uh, but uh, in in Revit uh, there's no and that we we yeah, we don't have that pattern. So let, let me just open uh, create a new. I'm just going to create a new project. Uh, I'll use the architecture template. Um, and uh, today I'm I'm using 2023 2023 because uh, I'm going to talk about uh, this uh, plugin as well. So I don't have that on my 2024. So uh, so that's why I am using 2023 today. Okay, so first, these are uh, usually they are. I think in this in, in this one, I think they they are just you know uh, surface pattern. But um, you can also use um, model lines, of course. So first, I'm going to just draw a curtain wall. W A curtain wall. Okay. So let's go to 3D view. So if if you don't um, want to use any of the surface pattern, so surface pattern is in the material. So so for example, this curtain wall tab, select one of the curtain panel, it edit the top. So this is the uh, material for the glass, the glazing. So if we go there, so you will see there's no surface pattern here. Okay. So if if you click on this. And um, and of course, there's no uh, that style surface pattern in here. So what? Um, oh, actually, I'm going to talk about this later. So first, it's possible to draw model line onto the surface. So what you need to do is just go set work plan, pick a plan, and just pick the surface of this class. So of course, you you need to have this one. Of uh, on, so you can directly pick pick the surface. If you if you have this one off, you will need to. So you you won't be able to pick the face here. So you need to move your cursor to the edge of this panel. So then that's it. So I usually just have this on, so it's easier for me to pick any of surface. So for example, I'll just pick this one, and then we can just model line. Just you can just directly draw lines. Copy. So yeah. So that's that's it. So that's the first one, first method. So of course, this means if you need to do this uh, to all these panels, so you need to copy and paste. That's quite a lot of work, right? But if if this is what you need, that that's it's 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 quite easy, right? Okay. So this is the first one. The second one is. Um, we are going to add a surface pattern. So if you go to, um, I think it's go to manage. There's a additional setting. So fill pattern. So this is the list. So we can um, we can choose this uh, to use in a for 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 uh, for material. But however, uh, there's no pattern like this one. So we need to download uh, a file. So it's a PAT file. So it's a P pattern file. So um, I actually download one just uh, I let uh, let me just have a look. Okay, so I think I had one uh, it's in this one. So you can see uh, oops. So it's a PAT file. So I I'll just uh, save this one to um, to there. Ah, oh, sorry, there. So all oh good. So let's close this one, this one, this one. So let's add that pattern. So fill pattern, um, and also uh, I think which one? So it should be model. Uh, I'm not sure which one. Let's try drafting first. So click on this uh, create new. So new pattern name. So let's call it glass and custom and then browse go to that folder so let's go 
download uh, where is it here okay so open and yeah so it looks okay here so let's click OK click OK so now let's go to uh, so first I want to select all se select all these model line I'll delete them and then select the panel go edit type click on here and uh, give give it a pattern so click on here so foreground um, where is it glass here is it oh. why is glass for uh, let's click OK oh, maybe it's not this one yeah maybe it, uh, that's that's the one let's have a look click OK apply yeah so that's it so now you can see the scales not quite right um, it's very big right oh uh, I think it's pr it's it's because um, because it's a drafting pattern so it, when you rotate your view it will change the pattern oh it's it's gone anyway so let's go to I think the scale is a bit too big so we need to go in to fill pattern and go to glass this one let's edit so see this one scale so let's just uh, make it 0.5 and okay okay yeah I think that's better okay so um, let's go to south elevation yeah that's it and also you can change the uh, color of the pattern so let's go to glass 4 edit oh sorry not here go. so go to material glass okay here so you can change the uh, color so for example change it to a gray apply yeah so that is it that, that, that's it that is it sorry okay so this is the second one um, now I'm going to talk about the third method okay so we're going to create a pattern ourselves so we're going to use this PWOT Revit uh, um, plugin so if you click on this one there's uh, this tool make pattern but bef that before that we need to draw something okay so I'm going to go to view create a drafting view um, maybe one two one okay so now I'm going to um, draw just use detail line okay so I'll just draw something like maybe uh, something like this and copy and mirror okay so and also I we need to draw uh, another DL and just do a box something like uh, like this okay and then I'll just copy this one to here so what and then uh, we can uh, let's I think that's probably it okay so now we need to go to um, PY Revit um, make pattern and okay so first we need to choose which one I think I will choose detail pattern and so select pattern to explore export um, not sure maybe this is the name I'll just type glass how about a class five uh, create um, from uh, not sure about these anyway so let's uh, uh, how do I do this I can't remember I think I did this before um, use high create field region no no I think there's uh, something I can choose to pick to point no line oh so see no line work selected so we need to select uh, I think we need to select these not the boundary um, <laughs> And click on make pattern. Okay, glass five detail. Okay, uh, that's good. That's good. I think that's all good. Click on create pattern. Okay, so now uh, it's asking pick uh, origin point. Maybe this one. Pick top right corner. Uh, maybe this one. Oh looks like something's not right it's all red uh, maybe let's try it again 
select this. Maybe we should pick this one as our origin point. <laughs> okay, so py uh, make pattern, name it five uh, detail. Um, oh, actually, let's try model. <laughs> Uh, and also here, I think click on create pattern, click on this one and this one. Yep, great. So let's click on OK. So now um, let's go to, let's have a look in additional setting, fill pattern. So it should be there, G, oh, model, G here. So now let's go back into here. So select glass and um, click on here, click on this, change this to model line, glass, okay, okay, okay. Oh, so looks like uh, it's not working. Mm, not sure why, maybe it's, I think it's, it's probably because of the scale. Mm. Let's try additional fill pattern model, Glass, edit. See if I can just reduce. Uh, so now we can we can't see anything. So maybe we need to reduce this by quite a bit. So yep, zero point one. Okay. Oh, that's <laughs> that's too much. Okay. So now, um, we need to change it back a little bit. Okay. So edit. Maybe zero point three. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's better. So now you can see because because it's a model pattern. So you can see when you rotate this, these uh, they won't move. Okay, if it's drafting, it will move. So I think model model will be slightly better. Um, yeah. So I think let, let me just increase this scale a little bit. Uh, model G glass edit. Maybe zero point five. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's it. So, um, and you can always, you know, try to adjust these uh, if you if you want if you like. So, um, so for example, I'm just going to move this down a little bit, uh, and we can just create another one. Select. Uh, make pattern glass six so model um oh scale maybe we can change it now um 0 0.4 maybe <laughs> create and place here here okay so click ok go back to 3d view select this glass edit click on here click here change it to class six okay 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 yeah so so that's oh it's quite quite nice just to each panel so yeah um yeah that that's it uh so this is how um we can we can create or we can download or create a pattern and then apply to the material okay so it will show these lines um on this uh, glazing. Okay, so that's all. Um, I think, yeah, it's this is probably the the best way to do this. It's better than uh, trying to uh, uh, draw model lines on them. So, um, if you have any questions, please let me know. I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye.